Hello my blind blokes and laid back lasses, and welcome to the Epic Tea Spill, a series where I review the weekly free Epic Games to see if you should ever download it, or just keep it in the depths of your library. If you want to skip this circus that I call my explanation of my thoughts, go to this time or go to the summary timestamp in the description. But if not, let's start off with... Shadow Wizard Money Gang, we love casting spells. So, this week's episode is about the games Black Book and Dodo Peak. Black Book is a dark RPG adventure game based on Slavic myths where you kill demons with cards and explore the world. Funnily enough though, Dodo Peak is basically the exact opposite. It's a throwback to classic arcade games with a modern twist. You play as a Dodo bird where you have to find and rescue lost babies from a series of dangerous peaks. But why just read their wikis to you when I could tell you what you're here for? So, as I said, Black Book is a card game, so you have to- And it's a pretty unique way to play it. As usual, you draw cards from a deck kind of thing, but besides that, it's completely different. To start off, we see that you don't keep the same hand every turn. Instead, you keep gaining random cards, and you have to think on your feet of how to de beat the demons or risk death. Yeah, that was dramatic, but uh, that isn't the only difference, though. Since it is a RPG, you can just go around and interact with the world in many ways, which are mainly killing demons, getting herbs to heal you, and helping people in towns between random quests. Anyways, I should probably move on to things like the art style. There are two things I'm going to talk about in the art style. The actual game and the art during talk scenes, but I'll start with the game. Obviously, the game isn't exactly unrecord or something, but there's something about the simple graphics with a cell shader that I love way too much. Like, it's perfectly simple and effective. I don't know what to say. Uh, anyways, the more interesting part, the art. It's so awesome, way better than it realistically needs to be. Not saying the game is bad, but just look at this. It makes me want to make feral grunts. If you're a fan of this channel, you may know how Russian things make me feel, but just look at it! It's beautiful! Sorry, I got a little too excited. But uh, let's move on to my feelings on it. It's kind of hard to wrap all of my thoughts on this game in an 8 minute video, but basically I would have to say Black Book is a great game. With not the best graphics and a very nice and unique gameplay loop, it's also accentuated by the fact that it's an RPG, so it has several endings, which reminds me of uh, other games, and a morality system, therefore giving it a lot of replayability. It also has a very simple story of a woman becoming a witch to get her lover from the deepest pits of hell. Which also means it's very relatable too. In total, I give Black Book a 9 out of 10 and the professionals agree with me, with reviews between 8 and 9 out of 10. Anyways, let's move on to the black sheep of this video, or should I say, the black dodo. Dodo Peak is a simple game that reminds me of Crossy Roads, and it's pretty fun. I should probably tell you the actual gameplay loop of it. So basically you start up where your eggs grow legs and walk away. But then you have to dodge enemies, spikes, and you're growing depression once you realize this is what you're wasting your life on. Anyways, it's a pretty good game. I would play it when I had nothing better to do or when I'm supposed to be doing something but I'm dumb and waste time. I rank it a 5 out of 10 and would not play it over any other game really, but it's still good. Um, the game journalists say the same thing at 53 on Metacritic, so yeah. This week's deals of the weeks are Pinball FX Indiana Jones Edition and Tachia. Uh, I'll butcher it, no matter. Uh, starting with Indiana Jones Pinball. It's pinball. If you like it, you like it. If you don't, you don't. It's really that simple. Anyways, Tachia is kind of like if Raft in the forest had a horribly muted child because Raft was cheating 
on the forest with Grounded. And when Tichia was born, right after, Raft magically disappeared. It's your fault, Lydia! Anyways, I think Tichia is worth buying, but who's gonna buy Indiana Jones Pinball? That's nice, Libero. I see they got you working the easy shift. Not me. I'm going in for my 36-hour shift at the ball-crushing factory, where they crush my balls! So, we have some random games this week, a game that is way too peak to be free, and a game that is about a stupid bird. I think obviously you know what you should get. Download Black Book, and if you're uber bored, which you shouldn't be because you just downloaded Black Book, you can decide to play Dodo Peak sometimes. Anyways, I'm new to reviewing, so if you could tell me something I could do better, or what I should add, please tell me. But if you don't, I'll just be here chilling, killing, and being a bad reviewer. Goodbye.